Hello, uh, my name is uh, Leir Antti Alcantara and I'm the age of 24 and I graduated in the batch of 2020 and I'm the featured artist for the month of March. Uh, honestly, I do have like a lot, you know, stuff to be expert on but actually I delve in much into 3D modeling like that 3D art I'm really into like creating stuff like that 3D texturing like that because I'm fun most of the computer games like that way before so yeah 3D modeling is what I've been uh, pushing through uh, up to until now let's say um when I was working on my thesis because I was creating a demo game for them. So it's a walking simulator game that, uh, that I work on the Unreal Engine. Actually, why it become uh, one of my remarkable projects is actually I spent a lot of time researching and working on that because Unreal Engine is not really taught here, uh, I mean on LPU way before. So I watched uh, like a lot of videos about Unreal Engine and how it works and created my own stuff. And I do have doubts way before because the panelists keep telling me that it's impossible to create the game with a span of three months like that. And they told me that there was before a student who created the game by his own. And it took him like a lot of his time and he didn't manage to graduate on time. And then they give me a choice to uh, maybe you should just do a uh, a storybook or something like that, mythical book, and and I just push it, and I just said I will gagwin kuputo, and I promise you I will deliver the product like a demo game like that. So yeah, it's actually very remarkable for me because let's say I'm learning from it while I'm working on it. So you find mistakes like that because things don't go well, things don't work. So yeah, I think I managed to pull it off and show them the product itself. Actually, I have no idea if I can get a decent job like that because what I'm aiming for is I really wanted to work as a 3D artist in a game company. So I tried like uh, applying to some gaming companies like IGG like that. And I started working on a Romanian based project. Like it's a mobile game. Currently now I'm working on a, well, actually a game, which I'm very happy and it's still on progress right now and at the same time creating on my modification for games like that so at the same time I'm working on a game itself like a comp game company and I'm working on my other portfolios ah <laughs> I think there's a lot I think um actually I'm fond of miniatures if you heard of like that like they're like tiny toys like that and you know like D&D &D, if uh, you guys know that but I'm more on a Warhammer side, so I love minis like that, so Warhammer 40k like that, and then I managed to uh, find the following like that to like 3D making like that, like Rafa Grassetti, ini idol ko siya. So he's like a um, very good sculpting artist. But yeah, mostly on Warhammer 40k side, all its artists like that because you know it's I'm really fond of the miniatures like that because it's so detailed. And it's so cool, you could paint those up uh, for your own like that. So you have your different flavoring on that toy. I was on that point, and uh, parang may gusto ko gawin pero hindi ko talaga magawa. Uh, you know, it's kind of frustrating like that because you wanted to accomplish that thing. And then uh, as an artist, like actually you wanted to upgrade on your work actually then you manage to see this very good artwork like that and then you keep thinking i want to be like them i want to be i want to have those that kind of output like that because i mean as artists we want our work to upgrade like that so i mean that's the tipping point for me because i'm i wanted to create that stuff but i can't because due to my lack of skill so you have to learn and learn practice every day like that and at the same time uh, i'm having my work now so it's kind of hard to go into your passion so you want to create better stuff like that so it's pretty hard but I, I can manage I mean I'm having fun at the same time follow your passion I mean building your passion is um, 
it's like a key, uh, let's say a stepping stone for having a good work. You just have to work on yourself. I mean, the creation you want to build up, the, the art you want to push in. So uh, that's why I'm in this position right now because I keep pushing what I want and passion itself. It's like a stepping stone for you guys, like the younger generation. Thank you uh, for having me. And uh, please follow my Instagram account, Ebonok31, where I featured my artworks. And you could see a link there with my art station, which you will also follow. And I think that's all. Thank you.